I picked this up a couple days ago at a thrift store for $12.97, not a bad price at all. And we're just gonna open it up and see what's inside, see if we can build what it says is in there. Well, that's a promising start. If it's already mostly built, let's pull out the manual. Very nice. And I see, let's just go ahead and grab, I don't know Harry Potter characters, I'm sorry, in advance. That, what's this bag here? Oh, that is, that is not this set at all. Did we get a two for one? That would be pretty rad. Okay. Oh, who is that? Okay. Okay. This all come out in one piece. More or less. Well, now I'm really excited about the potential of this if there's random people in here. Let's just try and not dump it all over the back. Okay, this might have been a bad idea. All right, okay, okay, okay. Let's set these aside. There's some random hair right there. Do you belong to this set? I don't think so. Maybe you do. Yes, he does. Just looked at the box. Okay, this looks mostly constructed already. You don't belong to this set, do you? Way. Okay. Oh, yeah, Tony Stark doesn't belong at Hogwarts. There's Dumbledore. She definitely belongs. Oh, that's a shame right there. It's not an expensive part to replace, but still a shame. Eh, not bad. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Great start. And there's the extra figures, and then the, uh, the extra set we got floating around here. I almost hesitate to do this, but that's so tempting. Yeah, I'm not going to take it apart. That is too easy. Not bad for $13, huh? That's great. 
And we had those three figures. And we still gotta figure out what's going on here. But kinda looks advent calendary to be honest. But I'm not sure. The leaky cauldron. There's a Christmas tree. Looks very advent calendary. There's a dreidel essentially. Um, but we will do our research. We also need to shout out a viewer who came through the store and bought some stuff. This is going out to Walker. Walker, thank you so much. Uh, I just, I'm always flabbergasted when you guys come through and buy something. You'd think I'd be used to it by now, but I am not. Everything from here this way. So a bunch of those, a bunch of those, and in blue and a battle droid. And I will, of course, uh, throw in some extra parts and some stickers and stuff for you. So thanks, Walker. Yeah, I just looked up this guy and that is an advent calendar. I was setting this up to take a photo for my Instagram and realized this piece just never made it in. Whoops. And since we're talking about orders coming in, we had a hundred dollar order come in, which is awesome. And uh, as far as I know, they're not a viewer. So I've already pulled it all out. Let's take a look. All sorts of pirate stuff, legend stuff, cars guy, some uh, collectible minifigures and horses. And this little rabbit guy, which is interesting. So Joe, if you are a viewer and you're just being super generous, thank you so much. And Joe, if you're not a viewer, thank you so much. All right, this one isn't worth doing its whole own video on. 297, picked up this Bionicle. And let's open it up and see if we can put it together. It's promising. It looks like I'm gonna have to look up instructions. Ew, what's going on there? That looks gross. We'll swap that out. All right. I was worried about this tape coming off, but it actually seems to be okay. I'm not ripping up the art. Good. Okay, I think we have a pretty significant piece missing. That one right there is not one I'm likely to have lying around. So I think I'll just do a general parts check, add that piece to my wanted list, and we will do that again in the future. All right, yeah, there's like three or four pieces missing. I've all added them all to my wanted list on BrickLink. And it's definitely not worth just ordering those pieces. Uh, just the value's not there. So I'm gonna wait until, uh, until I have a built up wanted list. Let's go ahead and call it there. I will catch y'all in the next video. See ya.